What's up, everybody? Really got to get this place cleaned up. Really got to get this place cleaned up. That's man. I got TVs, computers, all kinds of crap. Ola, how you doing, Shemay? Uh, I don't know how this place gets so wrecked up. I figured before I go goofing off somewhere on some kind of trip, I better get this stuff under control. Damn, what is this Tylenol? Do a little shop clean up today. What's going on, everybody? How you doing, Ray Ray? Um, welcome aboard, everybody. I just uh, got to get a little bit of control here. Um, it was trash day today. I wish I had put out some more stuff this morning. But that's about all I can do. I got the boss's big TV or 48 inch. We got to work on this baby. But I need a control board for that. that. Light shining in. How you doing, princess? Hey, Theodore, what's going on? Hey, it's so humid here. Is it humid there? Hey, Sawyer, how you doing? It's nice. Good to see you. Everything's going okay, Tyler. I just figured I better get the hell in the shop. This place really needs, a lot of stuff needs to be thrown out. Oh, I'll take a break from, I was going to do some metal detecting today, but I figured before I goof off, I should probably uh, do a little bit of cleaning. I always feel kind of guilty if I take off and I don't have a neat place. Oh, it, was a, it was a late night last night. I was getting hotels lined up. Uh, I've got to get this TV off of here. This is really bothering me. up uh, ginger how you doing hey jen jen just a little impromptu coming on hey leah hey madav good to see you uh, just doing a little time waster today sometimes it gets that i can hardly walk around the shop because uh, i got a lot of projects you know the the boss's uh, tv goes on the fritz and it comes home with me to be fixed uh, let me dump this. I'll be right back.
trash day in the hood today. Let's see if we can make room for this uh, TV. How's everybody doing today? Uh, better in your head. Humidity. Been raining since last Tuesday. It ain't gonna be raining here. How you doing? Uh, how you doing, Vern? Hey, Craig. Uh, let's make some room here. I have like five tripods in this house. Just take advantage of the downtime before travel just to get a few things done. Um, it's going to be a very slack time right now, and I kind of like that. I've been just going too, too hard at it. It's been great. But, uh, you know, it's good to take a break from, it's good to take a break from editing and shooting video right now just to get caught up. Because it is a lot of work. It's a hell of a lot of work. It takes a lot of time. And, uh, quite frankly, sometimes you just feel like dicking off, right? And not doing a damn thing except just kicking back watching a movie or something. I don't even know where to begin. I mean, I got this old 9-volt battery crap here. I don't think I'll ever use that saw again. Oh, how you doing, Diane? Oh, I'm not going anywhere. I'm just saying, um, no, I'm actually, I'm happy as hell. You know, I'm taking a lot of work. It's slow and steady, but I'm ecstatic. I got the, uh, you know, I got the channel pointed in a new direction, sort of breaking with the old, and I'm, I'm very happy about that. It's just, I'm the kind of person, if I see something like this, I imagine, like, uh, Missy Jen's still right here, right? And if she walks in, she blows a tube. <laughs> she blows a tube if she sees this mess, right? Uh, uh, yeah. Gotta always change stuff up in life, right? Uh, you gotta keep stuff fresh. You gotta you gotta do stuff that's gonna keep you engaged and keep you happy on the daily. So that's why I like uh, uh, YouTube because I can always make changes and change things up and all that. Things are looking okay. We're going to need that again. Now we can sit this TV down on the floor. So it just isn't working. They said they were watching TV. And all of a sudden. Just getting no. All of a sudden the picture just went whoop, to a little dot. The salmon was still good. But um, we've lost our main board in this baby. Or we lost our uh, backlighting. So, we gotta sit, sit that aside for a while. What's going on, everybody? Uh, plus, I'm really happy the pandemic is winding down. People are out doing more stuff now. That's kind of exciting been such a bad year. I think we can sit this over here now. Get this hell out of here. Ugh. I can't do anything to part your back water because of the chip shortage. All right. Sit you guys over here. Oh, well, thank you, Diane. Yeah, Missy Jen would sure as hell, she would have uh, surely blown it up, guys, if she sees this mess in here. Let me get this set down here. I always, uh, well, when, when she was around, I always worried about her tripping if she came in here. And uh, it's been almost a year. So I stopped really thinking about it. And then the funny thing is, I started to trip myself, right? And then I thought, oh shit, I better, uh, 
better get cracking here. I don't like LEDs, but I think I need a string for inside. Yeah, I was going to do some metal detecting today, but I thought, eh, you know, everybody's telling, go live, go live, you don't go live enough. I thought it might be a chance to go live today. Do a little work in the shop. Put this up top side, this Christmas stuff. Yeah, Missy Jen was the great, great motivator. Right. I didn't want her to ever fall down in the garage. Because you never know. She always liked to be creeping around everywhere. <laughs> Wrap those around. Rolled up magazine. Yeah, if I had any magazines, I would do that. My days of having magazines are long gone. Looking a little better. We got salmon fishing, which is going to be coming up. So you guys want to make sure you're a part of that. Um, it's a real physical struggle to go salmon fishing handling the big weights there's the refrigerator from the boss and janet that thing's kaput that ain't gonna run again put the van consolidate some of this fishing stuff here let's get this christmas stuff out of here oh good to see you guys today small but select crowd unusual for me i will be live later tonight i'm just Kind of killing time right now. What's going on? <laughs> Is this my lens dirty? I don't know. Crazy looking. Spooky. 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 Hey Kyle, how you doing? Hey Sharla. We're just killing a little time today, just kind of getting the program uncocked over here. You have to always imagine that the spirit of Missy Jen is always with us here. So I got to put up this Christmas lights and then we'll consolidate all the fishing stuff. We got to get ready for salmon fishing. And salmon fishing is very interesting. Very kind of physically taxing. No, that's all my stuff. Um, <sighs> so you have these things called uh, breakaways that you put on your line. And you're supposed to open it up. And kind of put your big weight in there. And this baby's like four pounds. Doesn't sound like a lot until you're hauling it along. Is that working? It's very hard to pull this back. There it is. Then you put that out there. One end goes on your line towards your rod, and the other end has the live bait, has the bait on it, the baited hook with the little um, sardine or whatever. And when the salmon hits that sardine, it pulls this spring release and it drops the weight to the bottom of the ocean there. And then you only have to fight the weight of the salmon. But uh, these things, people are swinging these on the deck. They're almost knocking each other out and everything. <sighs> Key to clean and work just one square foot of space at a time. Uh, what's up, Theodore? How you doing? Yeah, so things are going good. I've been really happy with um, better communications with YouTube lately. I think I've got a good chance of getting this whole monetization thing settled. In the next two weeks, I hope. By August at the latest. Not that that's the driving force. It's just been a real pain in the ass. 
I'm happy about that. I didn't put anything away from the job that we did. We got all this crap here. It's up. Is that the mail uh, mail guy came? I don't know. Let me see if the mail guy came. I don't know. I had the, uh, the mechanical contractor I had to come out this morning. They have to certify your. Uh, backflow device so that well water doesn't get into the city lines. Just another friggin' money maker. The mail guy, it's time for lunch. What about lunch? We have a garage to clean, so don't worry. It's always great to see you in the shot. I need to straighten my, I need to straighten my shop up. And uh, I need to sell or junk some of this old equipment that um, you know I accumulated over 25 years it just is never going to be incorporated into anything all right let me uh, let me get the ladder and I'm going to stick this this is where the black widows roam up top here let me see if I can get this Christmas stuff back up here without nothing myself. Ooh, ow. Or pinching my hand in the ladder. So, yeah, I felt kind of too guilty to go on the road today. So I kept thinking about Missy Jen. Uh, let's see if we can avoid a big juicy of black widows up here. Although I like them, I just don't need one dropping right in my face. And this place is just loaded with 10,000 of them in here. Oh, all up here on the upper deck up there. That's like prime, prime. How you doing, Morley? I guess I am pretty sexy. It's all prime. Widow country. Here. That web right there. You can always tell black widows just make really goofy looking webs that are all around me here right now. They're all around. They're all here. Tons of them. Can just feel them all crawling around. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I don't need that on. Or too cheap. The older we get, we just get down to one light bulb in the whole house, right? We get cheap. You don't have them in the UK? Oh, I have this. I love Black Widows, actually. I love their sleek, oh, I like their sleek, very high gloss bodies and that beautiful hourglass on the bottom of just, it's like nature's most spectacular spire. I mean, I know the ones in Australia, the Black Widows are even weirder looking. But, um, okay, so this looking a little better already in here. What do you mean, what's going on with Missy Jen? Missy Jen's fine. She's over and uh, getting ready to head back to Germany. That was her original plan. After stopping her own stomping grounds, she's been good enough. God love her for taking care of people with very serious, serious health issues. <coughs> Clean up some of the tools. I never put my tools away from all of the uh, job. Uh, yeah, I would have started the. Uh, oh boy. <laughs> I'm really glad people are out and about on YouTube now. It's just. You know. 
whole year is just too much time to be cooped up. I hope the people up in um, Canada are able to get out soon. The old kind of compass dividers, great for scribing in angles. And, let's see, saw blades. I think I keep my saw blades over there. Oh boy. What's up everybody? How you doing today? Going I haven't gone floating this year. I gotta let uh with diacromatious earth kill black widow spider. I'm not sure, I hope not. Uh, I rear. I really never kill anything. <clears throat> I just feel too guilty. You know, like who appointed me like God of the universe, right? So uh, I'm actually, you know, I seem, I seem pretty tough, right? Right. I seem tough as nails, but. Uh, I got a heart of gold, right? Oh man. Put some of these away. There are blades. You know, I figure as long as it doesn't hurt me, I'm alright with it. And I don't really think a black widow bite will kill you. My luck, I'd be the slob that gets taken right out. <sighs> Wink. It's really looking a little better in here already. Next thing I got to do is get real brutal in throwing stuff away. And I'm not going to use anymore. Uh, pizza's here. Got to go. Okay. Yeah, thank you for being kind. Thank you, Diane. Any s'mores at that fire? Yeah. Oh, well, thank you, Red Roan Runner. I've had this for years. Um, I don't know who in the hell somebody sent it to me. I don't know who years ago. Um, I think, um... Gal that lived in uh, Oklahoma, obviously, she sent it to me. I'll be damned if I can think of her name right now. She absolutely loved me. Right? Because I'm so friggin' lovable. You're looking a little better. This is stuff for the van. Let's consolidate all of the uh, fishing crap over here. Oh. oh yeah, here's all the big weights. These are a lot to handle on the end of a fishing. These are 40 ounce weights. The only downside of salmon fishing dealing with the damn weight. Ooh, ooh. thing when you go salmon fishing though they uh they provide you with all the pre-baited hooks you just hook on that makes it kind of easy that makes it kind of easy that's looking pretty good this is my inner tube for floating on the river i think that'll be coming soon the russian river is so low though i think because of the lack of rain it's pretty spooky <sighs> I don't even know if they're going to put up the dam this year. I don't even know. 
what kind of rod to use with a 40 ounce weight this is um Boss bought me this reel, nice big uh, pen reel here. This is it, and I have a uh, 80 pound test line on here. That's what I use. My big boy. Going in there. I think it's an ugly stick. Yeah, the Tiger, Shakespeare Tiger. It is. The duty is 70 inch medium light, 70 inch medium light, 30 pound test. Yeah, it does me good. We take a few rods out with us. The salmon fishing will be coming up. That's always a good time. Share out of here. Get up early in the morning now. Hey, let it go. Heavy duty salmon. AMJ hey, used to be three pound when a fish by you. Uh, yeah, they're still using the uh, drop weights though. That's what we use the uh, release ball. Um, um, that's still what this captain uses on the new sea angler. So you gotta fish what he says to fish. Because as he said, you need to have a uniform presentation of baits in the water. Or else or else the fish get uh, the fish get confused, right? Catch you later, power cut for tree removal. Hope you are well. What's up, Andrew Scott? How you doing? Uh, heavy duty rod, yeah. I uh, actually enjoy. Um, hell, that thing's blanking me out back there. It's a no makeup day. I actually enjoy the um, rock cod fishing more than salmon because I don't. I'm not really a big salmon eater. It's okay. It's on the grill the first night. It's fresh, but I'm not much. I like cod. Oh my God. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to do a little tidy up, Andrew. It just gets to be a little much in here. What I need to do is just go through here and just throw uh, just deep six stuff. I know I'm never going to use again. Right? It's just the way it is. You got. I got big boxes of electrical supplies and. Uh, ten years ago, I moved to the Rancho. Ten years and three days ago. <sighs> I'm just hanging out with you guys a bit today. Uh, love rock cod. I like rock cod too. I'm just not a big salmon. Even though the salmon we catch is the wild Pacific King salmon. Sells for $14 to $15 a pound in the store. We come back with 40 pounds dressed. At the end of it, red snapper's good. Red snapper's good. Mm. Not a big fish eater. I'm surprised uh, over there in the uh, United Kingdom that... Uh, Scotland, Wales, and uh, Britain. That uh, you're not a big, um, not a big fish eater. So, I guess what I decided today, guys, was just kind of tackle this a little bit and get out from under. And I'm gonna have to load up the van and make a run to the uh, junkyard here and get rid of a lot of uh, crapola that I know I'm not gonna use again. Just really do a really do a cleaning on this. Uh, really do a cleaning on this thing. How you doing, Mark? Yeah, lots of fish farms. It's amazing. They need fish farms being in the UK. There. That's pretty amazing. Over there. Uh, 
Yeah, uh, MJ, this is the breakaway thing where the weight goes on and then the weight drops once the salmon hits, boom. And, uh, you know, the lead weights are expensive these days. Lead ain't cheap, and every time you don't, you lose that salmon, you lose a weight. That kind of sucks. That kind of sucks. What's your next trip fishing or um, back out in the RV? Probably tomorrow. I'm gonna be heading out. Um, today I just felt like I had to get a few things done at home. I had to get out from under this. Um, uh, you know, I need my workbench. I gotta fix the boss's TV. I'm waiting for back order parts to be available for that. So, um, always more adventures coming up. I mean, it's, it's, it's going to be the most exciting times in the history of the channel coming up, which I really like. The most exciting times. Let's see. Let's go out to the orchard a little bit here. What's going on? I've got to go through all of this crap. <sighs> That's where I get out and get a little sunshine there. Here are the crows, they just drive me crazy. They like to roost in this big tree up here. Be up there. We gotta get this uh, lawn mower here. We gotta get this swinging into action and get this work. And this is the one that the boss gave me i haven't done a damn thing on that i guess we should pull that into the shop and start to do the um uh, get that handle fixed up on that i think we'll probably do that today here's some of our not going to have a lot of plums this year we're doing pretty good they're pretty good size santa rosa plums what's disappointing is virtually all the oranges over here just fell off all those blossoms i don't know it's just too dry what the hell it was same thing with this one it just all fell off yep peaches are doing okay just too damn dry it's just too much drought <sighs> yeah I like Santa Rosa plums these are the elephant heart plums on this one these are the real dark purple juicy red and purple they don't come till August not a lot of them no it's it's about 80 degrees right now it's very comfortable Our next project there. Uh, let's have antifreeze. Oh, just been sitting out of here a while. Gotta clean that up. We need to get this. Uh, we need to get this handle put on here. I don't know if we have a C clip or not for that. See if we can pop that baby on there. Let's see if we can pop this mofo on there. Watch it. This is all like Spire City here.
That goes back this way. We need to get a C clamp on there. I don't know if I got a C clamp. This thing is all off. This thing is all cocked up. Gasoline. I think that's it right there. I think that's it. We gotta get a C ring or something on there. I don't know. Gotta go in the shop and see if we got a C ring. Yeah, Rosie, why do you have so many lawn mowers? Well, Anytime so somebody says you want something, the answer is always yes. That thing's kind of off kilter, isn't it? clamps or not let's see if we got any clamps still got my pumpkins I'm so proud of them what is Susie talking about what's up Susie finally starting to warm up there huh I haven't seen a rose of plums in years See if we got the where in the hell is there? We got a C ring thing, but I don't think we got any. We got our snap ring set, but I don't think we got any rings. So ten years here, I got every tool you can imagine, but I don't think I have any. Uh, snap rings I guess we'll just have to let that go till we get some Etsy. Who's doing Etsy? I think that's about all we can do in here today. How you doing, Michelle? 
at least I've got a clear path in here now. It's not too bad. Not too bad, but I need to throw a lot of crap out. I have to get some big contractor bags and just fill them with this crap. Those I had to buy. Let's sit you guys over here. Oh, Plug that in. Oh, there we go. I'm just still kind of cleaning up a little bit and getting shit done. motivator for cleaning up that's for damn sure Get a yogurt going here. Let's get a yogurt. Your daughter has an Etsy shop. Awesome. Nice. Good deal. Let me go wash my hands here. I'm glad to hear that, Charlotte. That's cool. That's really cool. That is really great to hear. The only other person I knew with an Etsy shop was uh, RB Deb. She does a lot of beading and stuff. I don't really see her doing too much anymore. I don't really see her doing too much. Let me get the big screen on here. Sucks. That sucks. We got a little bit more. Should we go blueberry today? I usually have two of these because these are 90 calories each. Yeah, I don't have any more. Looks like a college fraternity house refrigerator. Nothing inside of it. Let me get this on here. Let me get this on here. All right, there we are. Let's see if we can get that up there. Yes, here we are. Thank you, guys. Let me turn the volume off. There we go. Yeah, I love blueberry. Lots of moaning and groaning. Really, Lieutenant Dan? What are you doing over there? Sounds like Lieutenant Dan is having a little bit of... Get down! Get down, baby! Get down, get down. Get down, you mofos. Get down. Get down. What's up, Chef? Your workshop is an afternoon they call. I know I should call a date over. That's a, that's a, that's a real chick magnet, you know. Oh, 
Oh, I just get so horny when I think of Rosie's workshop there, not... <laughs> I don't know. Is this thing cutting out or something? What's going on? It's very intermittent. Is that picture cutting in and out or is it okay? What's going on? It's weird. Yeah, nothing. Chips like nothing more than greasy hands and um, dirty fingernails and the slovenly approach to life looks fine see this is weird this is just like uh cutting out here and that's strange look at that never seen that before son of a is that weird or what it's like it's stuck or Something dumb like the refresh on the screen is bad. Now weird. Hey Chris Bliss, how are you? How you doing, love? Let's see if we can straighten that anyway. Go to full screen. Nope, I don't know what's going on. We might just have to restart the computer here. Oh, don't tell me my computer I've been using here since 2000. Uh, 2013 is finally starting to give up the ghost in the kitchen. Let's restart the computer. Restart. It's YouTube. This, as long as the chick is not into things like the, like the, like the house of a thousand corpses. What I couldn't watch my own videos. It's I don't know, man. YouTube has been. They've been screwing up the subs. They've been. Uh, you know, you'll be flat for a couple weeks and all of a sudden they come surging in. I think YouTube is being hacked on a daily basis. I really believe that they're being uh, messed with on the daily. I really do believe that. This is my 2000, 2012 HP small form factor computer. I've been using it for eight years. I'm telling you, Chris Bliss, I know what the hell's going on, honey. And uh, those hackers are having a field day with YouTube right now. Because nobody's, uh, nobody's sub stuff is working correctly. Everything is all screwed up. Hey, Teresa, how you doing? You know, notifications aren't going out, but I'm rarely on on the daytime. Restart that computer. I love the sound of XP. Wait for it. Here it comes. I love Windows XP. Still my favorite. Still my favorite, baby. Still my favorite. So I have a feeling that um, YouTube is being hacked like crazy right now. I'm done. Just I've been eating pretty good. I think I'm just all filled out in all the right places. Alright, well it just started up again. I do love my Windows XP. You'll never get me off of it. That hasn't been supported in five years and I don't care. That means nobody messes with it. Right? Right, let's see if we can get on the net. Trash day in the hood today. Uh, surprise, we got 60 people here at 1 30 in the afternoon in California time. Uh, did you feel an earthquake in California? I did not, honey. 
where was it uh, where was it located NorCal or SoCal up here I was up late last night booking hotels Community message shooting on Burbank Avenue suspect outstanding. Well, that's close to home mm. That's always a nice thing to see in the hood it's Always cool Malang, oh, I hated that. Hey, Ronnie. Let's see. Um, let me see. Let's see if this is, let me see if I can watch myself now. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Let's see if, we're, let's see if this thing's working now. If it's working, it's me. If it's not, it's them. No, still doing it. Still doing it. Look at this craziness. That craziness is still cutting out. Look at that. I like that nonsense. Weird. How you doing, Kimia? Let's go on to our blueberry here. Yeah, I wonder if it happens on anybody else's. I don't know. This whole thing has been so glitchy. Screwy thing. Three times the chat, three X the chat. We can see you in the UK. Thank you. It will play if you sign out of YouTube. Well, I ain't gonna do that. I'll just know that YouTube has been really super glitchy. And that's the bottom line. Weird ass thing. Someone said up there was doing it the, the, to them as well, I bet. Oh, what the hell's going on? I don't know, what do you guys feel like doing tonight? I don't know. I feel like doing something on the road. So now it said an error occurred, please try again later. So it's just weird. You know? I don't know what it is. What's up, Scottish? How you doing? Earthquake under Disney Island. Disneyland. Uh, I'm pretty sure God doesn't like Disneyland. I think the pr ticket prices are too high, right? <laughs> That's just God weighing in. I don't know. Thing just sucks here. Just sucks. I can watch the side chat on it. Oh man, I miss Jackie Gleason, huh? Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. From Miami Beach. It's the Jackie Gleason Show, starring the June Taylor Dancers.
Let me just stop this from running. And I can just follow the side chat. I'm not sure. What should we do tonight? Love you too, Cheryl. What should we do tonight? We got to do something tonight. I can't film in the casino anymore. They know me on site down there now. They shut me down. I said, come on, man. I've helped put you guys on the map. They're like, we know, we know. But uh, people get tired of, you know, people, video cameras, they get all pissed off when they're playing and they lose. <laughs> hey, you've been in, your daughter's enjoying the family. Yeah, good. Good deal. So, uh, you know, so uh, what do you guys feel like doing? I'm kind of in this just down period before I start uh, jury duty next week. You want to see a fashion show. I don't have that many uh, fashions. I got to get those shoes uh, fitted up to me, Shemay. Um, got to also go to the P.O. box. Today might be the day for that. We should haul up to the P.O. box. See a fashion show. Pizza. Make a pizza. I don't know. I don't think I have anything to make a pizza. Hello, Brian. Uh, uh, civil. Uh, it's going to be criminal court, Tony. Going to be criminal. Outdoor cooking, whatever you decide to do up here. I just don't have anything. To, what the hell? I don't got anything thawed. What we need is some kind of outdoor adventure. I'm not sure about, uh, you know, cemeteries. Why doesn't somebody go out there and put some money in this? <laughs> <laughs> Why don't y'all go out there and put money in that cemetery again? <laughs> that was my best. That was my best cemetery trip ever, right? <laughs> oh, I love that. It's, it's funny, it's scary. Uh, I'm new to watching you. Can you tell me a little bit about your? It's all in my videos, Diane. All you have to do is go back to my oldest videos and come forward. All about being trans issues and transgender. I need to put up new ones. Um, so. Kitchen Stadium is always a welcome treat. Yeah, that was fun with the scrabbing. Yeah, remember the poo sock of doom? Um, maybe we should do some uh, explorations today. Maybe we should go out to like Sebastopol tonight. Or Petaluma. What do you think? We haven't been to Petaluma in a long time. <clears throat> been there in a long time. Yeah, that was fun with the scavenger hunt. We haven't been there in a long time. I think maybe we'll go down to Petaluma tonight. Um, what is it, Wednesday night? Yeah, it should be pretty hopping down there. What do you think, guys? It's probably been three months since we've been to Petaluma. Oh, thank you, Cheryl. Love you. Uh, yeah, why don't we? Uh, why don't we go live from Petaluma tonight? Maybe we'll have some Turkish food or something. I'd like to go drink a beer in the park. <laughs> Maybe I should take a sleeping bag and overnight in the park. So when the sprinkler system comes on at 4 a.m. Sounds fun, huh? That'd be kind of cool to spend a night out on the streets, huh? Y'all would be worried though, watching like hawks all night long. Uh, what's it, Schulenberger? Schulenberger Park just walks out to where the Petaluma River is. It's pretty boring down there. Uh, it's like at the uh, west side of uh, the. Uh, river the east side of the river i mean 
have you walked all the cities within no I don't I haven't walked all of them um, walked all the major ones uh, Bodega Bay is just too dangerous to walk around there there's no sidewalks or anything out there um, fun with you every time yeah we always have a good time uh, Pat Loom is always fun have you ever been to Miami? Yes, I have. Not on not on YouTube, but I have been to Miami. Yeah. Uh, my YouTube trips to Miami started at the YouTube bottom of YouTube meetup of uh, 2015. Down there, down in Clearwater, and that's where we met Drury. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Joe Kalanji and my pal Drew. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Hey, is that uh, Alicia? How you doing? In a pantaloon golf club and yell for it every time she swing a club. Yeah. Yeah. I think probably we'll just go, I think that's probably a good idea, we'll go to, we'll go to Pat Luma tonight and hang out. I think that'd be a lot of fun down there. And, uh, yeah, then next week I got jury duty call, calling me. That pretty much sucks. Oh God, let go to the uh, Pet Cemetery. <laughs> Hell's a pet cemetery. Uh, have you been to Roseland? I live in Roseland, right here. I'm right in the heart of Roseland. Right in the heart of it. Used to be an independent, unincorporated part of the city. Tiny little island in the middle of the city, but it finally got incorporated in 2019. Yep, so I am in the heart of Roseland right here. Rocky Memorial Park in Petaluma. What the hell is that? I don't know. I got chased out of a cemetery in Petaluma. The one time I tried to go over the wall. Hey, what are you doing? The cemetery's closed. What? Can't you fucking hear me? The cemetery's closed. Okay. Thank you. Fuck you. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, looking for nearby towns for you to um, <clears throat> visit. Sebastopol is always fun. Um, see, things are really going to be gearing up starting in, uh, after jury duty. We just need to fill a little time. Going to be back to Vegas fun and then um, down to SoCal again. And then uh, we got the big trip, big adventure coming down to Mexico. I do mean big adventure. Nevada is pretty boring. San Rafael, I've done that. San Rafael. It's just that uh, the earthquakes destroyed a lot of these towns. So what you're seeing is rebuilt ugly ass towns. Petaluma is very nice down there. Poor Andrew, he's trying hard. How about Novato? <laughs> mm. When is Oakland going to be in the lineup? <clears throat> That'll probably be um, between uh, Vegas and when we start the Mexican adventure. That'll probably be Oakland in there. And we'll do a we'll do a Berkeley too. People seem to like Berkeley, all the crazy ass people on Telegraph Avenue and People's Park and all that bullshit. Uh, Schollenberger Park. It's just not anything down there. It's just, you know. Uh, hey, Rev Lowe, how you doing? The problem with Schollenberger Park is just a trail that goes down and just walks around. <laughs> Grasslands. We got to be where the action is, right? We got to be on the streets. 
Uh, yeah, I've done Berkeley before, what was called the Bad Boys Tour. I think I did that 2016 with Missy. I went to San Quentin, the Death Row gift shop there. You can actually tour San Quentin, just don't wear jeans when you go down. That's it, you prearrange it. Driving can text. Hey, how you doing, Liz? Do, 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 do. Berkeley's a lot of fun. It's good to see Rev. So, I'm just chilling now. This is what, uh, what is Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. This is uh, day four of uh, no smokes, feeling good. No issues, no cravings, no nothing. Feeling pretty good about that. That went surprisingly easy. Happy about that. But that, yes, that's going real good. So I think it's going to be Petaluma tonight, guys. I don't think we're going to be going out till about uh, 9 p.m. Trio, Nanadale State Park, what's that? It's just like a state park. It's by Spring Lake. Not really boring as hell. <laughs> Another very boring area over there. I was watching the show and they said Chooch mean idiot. Now quote the uh yeah there Chooch does mean idiot in Italian when you go chooching. You're being an idiot. That's literally what chooching is, right? It's known as the Idiot's Walkabout. That's it. I'm not good at the game yet. <laughs> Teresa, that's fine. You know, people don't want to see you around a park, walking around a park. Uh, you know, people like to be where the action is and uh, all that. So. <laughs> yeah, it's a good chooch. Uh, were you adventurous as a kid? I was very adventurous, yeah. Hey, Soswald, how you doing? I was forever the uh, kid that was always getting in trouble in the family, always the one that uh, climbing on top of ch rooftops of churches and rolling my own cigarettes out of binder paper and pipe tobacco and hooking school, trying to. But my mother was way too smart for me. She come whipping around that corner like Kojak. You're going the wrong way for school. <laughs> I don't feel good. Bullshit. <laughs> you never get sick. Go back to school. <laughs> Before I beat the hell out of you. <laughs> Remember guys, this was Baltimore, all right? That's pretty funny. That's pretty funny. Uh, so, yeah, I've always been a square rule follower until I found, uh, until you found liquor, huh? There you go. I always, I always been marching to the beat of my own drummer. I was always a class clown. I was always the one to, uh, be cutting up with the girls, trying to mess with the girls and all that. Trying to make the girls laugh. Right. How you doing, Mew? What's going on? A little Wednesday time waster. Hey, Jessica, how are you? Uh, yeah, I'm having a nice day, Prince. I'm just having a real quiet, simple day. I'm trying to clean up some stuff around the uh, house. The ghost of Missy Jen is circulating and I'm not very happy about the state of the state. 
<laughs> Not very happy about the state of stuff, so. <clears throat> Yeah, so just a simple day today. I'm going to be really uh, light on YouTube till, for the most part, till after this jury duty drive is over. And then, and then it's going to be heavy duty content, uh, pounding that heavy duty. My mother raised and saw the best partner in her name. She was ashamed of me. I was always on the honor roll. I had a crush on Dodney Osmond. Nothing wrong with that. I probably had a crush on Marie. I don't know. Marie Osmond was a little too sweet for me. I needed a girl that was kind of like a, a little bit of a bad girl, you know? Uh, Marie Osmond, you can hit on that till the cows come home and not get a damn thing. <laughs> <laughs> right? He come up dry on that one. You'd be like trying to drill those wells and just coming up another one, man. A guy can only take so much of that and then he becomes then he turn into an Elvis, you know? <laughs> Uh, Italian word chucho I means jackass, dummy, and moron. A chucho is a person. Yeah, that's fun. That's what we go. And they call it. Probably. Steve sold band aids, then went back and gave them back and swept out his storeroom. That's funny. You know, but, uh, you know, with the Marie Osmond, you just weren't getting any, man. <laughs> you just weren't getting any. <laughs> It was tiger than a two dollar pistol. <clears throat> Just not part of the Mormon Empire, you know. Let's have a cup of coffee here. Look at my change jar. Yeah, Marie's not happening. Oh. Oh. Look at that, man. Look at that. That baby, that's 25, 30 pounds right there. Look at that. I'm a little bit country. Yeah, I would have liked to have cracked uh, Valerie Bertinelli's not too. That would have been all right. Yeah, with Eddie Van Hale, and I was like, I blew her off. That was the end of that, right? And they had Wolfie, and I'm like, really? I have a dog named Wolfie. <laughs> Wolf <Wolfgang. laughs> Crushed on Bobby Sherman, huh? Kerching. I don't know. We're just we're describing all of our secret crushes and stuff today. Yeah, I'm a little horny today, I ain't gonna lie to you guys. <laughs> since, I, uh, since I finally quit the smokes once and for all. <clears throat> Remember, we're always honest here. We're always honest. <clears throat> Head Loomis tonight, huh? To start with the coffee to get energized down there. What's new, Pussycat? Whoa, <laughs> Susie's like, you had Leaf Garrett on my walls. Nice. <laughs> Be sure to check for, uh, yeah, pre-cut, yeah, pre-65. I already checked all that out. I'm all good to go on that. I don't have many valuables in life. I like to be just go through life like a smooth ball. Right? Not like my porcupine Cheryl somewhere out there. Uh, uh, 
<sighs> Leaf Garrett, maybe I should have. Ooh, it is hump day. Hey, look, we all get horny once in a while, right? Better take an allergy pill if we're going out tonight. Quite as often as I should. Mm -hmm. Do -do -do. Mm. Ah, I need to have a new Queen of the Rancho contest. Right. They're all like, are you kidding? I wouldn't be caught there living in that enterprise. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Joni. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not. I'm gonna hit the road about 6 p.m. Should be in Petaluma about 6:15 and be underway. Cause I like to. I like it to be dark. I like to hit the alleys of doom. Um, see if we run into any weird or interesting people. Crush. Ah, oh, Cheryl, you're so sweet. Yeah. Maybe I. Oh, you Ooh, quite as often as I should. Ooh, live it. Yeah, you're always on my mind. Uh, yeah, it's going to be around six o'clock. I'm with my trans friend, Amelie. Could she have a shout out? Hey, Amelie. Shout out to you. Awesome. Got the trans sister there for you. <clears throat> That's pretty cool you're hanging with her. I'm going to go see if the mail came. I'll be right back, guys. <laughs> We got mail out the wazoo today. Woo! We got a little love letter from the Santa Rosa Water. They want to attach my friggin' well. Now they want to tell me how much I can pump out of my damn well, right? That's what that's going to be. Look at this Santa Rosa Water. This city. Drought alert, dear Santa Rosa water customer. Here we go. Our region is facing historic drought conditions due to two consecutive years of well below average rainfall. Santa Rosa, along with communities in Sonoma, Marin, and Mendocino County, all rely on the Russian River for drinking water, fire, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. As the largest city in the North Bay, it is critical that all Santa Rosans act now to preserve our precious water supply. <sighs> On Tuesday, May 18th, Santa Rosa City Council adopted a 20% voluntary community-wide water use reduction target. I hardly use any at all. To bring, you, to bring the savings to you, the hell is this? Customers can access water saving tips, free water. I'm not even watering the front lawn, right? 
to bring you savings Santa Rosa Water is hosting a drought drop-by event on Saturday, June 12th at the Sonoma County Fairgrounds. Pick up water saving kits. It includes a bucket. <laughs> I guess you're supposed to shit in a bucket. High efficiency shower heads. Right. Okay, well there's $100,000 of mailing costs to bring that news to you. That we already mean you don't find really any swimming pools out here i mean some of the rich cats do what's this wells fargo fair fund what the hell is that i don't know what the hell is this Good lawyers be advised the United States versus Rosie O'Kelly. <laughs> You've been identified for illegal insider trading. Right. <clears throat> In the matter of Wells Fargo and company, what are we suing Wells Fargo now or what are we doing? Wells Fargo Fair Fund. I don't even know what the hell that is. What is that? What the hell it is. If there's money to be made though, I'm this son of a bitch is gonna grab it. What the hell this is? Find something. Plan for more fruit trees, huh? Maybe uh I like lawyers send you all this crap. Looks like bullshit to me. Looks like just bullshit mail today. Right. How you doing, Nicole? What's going on? <laughs> Lawyers. Oh, just imagine if I was a lawyer. I would be a courtroom lawyer. I'd love to be a courtroom litigator and yell at somebody. You mean to tell this court? Answer the question. Objection. Sustained. Let me rephrase the question. Were you or were you not with the defendant on the night of... Blah, 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 blah. Doing okay. Just getting on the best I can. Yeah, I'm doing all right. I'm just slack times on YouTube. I'm taking advantage of it to um, get stuff cleaned up before the next adventures begin. You need a little bit of downtime. You'd be fantastic, huh? with uh, twisting that all around and wordsmithing and uh, wrapping up to the jewelry, making that jewelry just weep tears. <laughs> Be a defense attorney. Yeah, the short Ally McBeal uh, suit skirt. That's it. That's exactly right. Um, yeah, Ally McBeal, I remember that. Yeah, I remember that show. Man, that was years ago, wasn't it? I don't know. Just like, uh, was that Nanny McPhee? <laughs> Whatever the hell that was. Who in the hell knows? On the Ally uh, McBeal, I don't know. Uh, not to be confused with uh, uh, Nanny McPhee or whatever. <laughs> Your date's here. Holy shit. <laughs> Where are we going to go on the date tonight? We're going to go to the bridge so I can jump off. <laughs> That's where we're going. <laughs> it's our date tonight. Just drop me off at the Golden Gate. Let me just end it. <clears throat> Two years ago, unclaimed money from something my mother had. It was like 22 bucks, but no, if you look, they usually have uh, scams, yeah. 
Uh, <laughs> so much for being horny, horny. Portia de Rossi. I am horny today. I noticed when I quit smoking, my, uh, she's telling me to get on to this matter of the Queen of the Rancho. Let's get on it. Maybe I showed you. Karen Silkwood. <laughs> You've been horny tonight or whatever. No, not so much lately, Nicole. Not too much the last year. But I don't know. Things have been going good lately. I think I might be finally coming to the end of the tunnel on all this YouTube monetization crap. And uh, traveling's now picking up. And I'm feeling pretty damn good. I'm feeling pretty happy. I like the downtime on YouTube. I like the fact that people are out, are out doing stuff now. I'm just glad to kind of gear down and slow, slow down for a little bit. Uh, uh, and watched her on Arrested Development. Get on in and stay in horny. That's it. Get right Ah, I gotta behave. We gotta behave. Seventy-six degree weather. This is hell. I remember the freezer. I remember you sitting on the block of ice in your freezer. Yeah, <clears throat> trying to cool off. I received two checks from New Jersey unclaimed last week. There's a nationwide version too. Well, good for you there, Shemay. The money just kind of falls out of the sky. Usually shit I get is demanding money. I'm finally traveling again this summer to Idaho and Yellowstone. We're, oh, good for you. That is awesome. Traveling. Traveling away. That's really cool. Yeah, Petaluma tonight. Could be a night to have a beer in the park, right? Maybe I control so to get your money from commercial. Can you counter sue to get your money you would have received from commercials? I don't know. Somebody call me a lawyer. <laughs> no, you can't sue me. Oh, you mean for YouTube stuff? No, you can't do that. Can't do that. We're making new, we're breaking new legal ground here on YouTube with this. If you get to Alabama, girl, uh, coast, let's surf fish. There we go. Is that the uh, chunky, chunky trailer? I like that. Yeah, surf fishing. I like that. It's like we get down to Mobile, Pascagoula, all down there. How you doing, Glenda? What's going on? Love that down there in Alabama, Mississippi, down on the coast. Uh, Rosie, you think YouTube's going to make it like they seem to be scrambling to try and get revenue? I'm not sure, Nicole. I'm, I think YouTube's have a massive... I think YouTube is under steady hacking attack lately. Everything is all screwed up on the features. Um, you can just tell that there's something weird going on. There's more and more errors that are showing up. I mean, they've got so many irons in the fire now with uh, super chats and super stickers. That's had to have yielded them a fortune, right? But they'll always be uh, anal probing us for more. We'll never die unless they get too uh, corporate greedy. Well, they didn't used to stuff as many commercials in when you watch something. That's just like, wow. 
It's like, well, we, well, we, well, we. Uh, I don't know, Nicole. After seven and a half years, I can say the, the platform has just uh, continuously, uh, continuously impressed me with its shittiness. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse numbers, cooking books. I don't know what's going on. I'm uh, <laughs> a dance like damn. <laughs> I'm not to do whatever they take from Super Chat. But that's why I'm, I'm really glad more people have done the PayPal. It's, the, it's been helping me a lot. The Super Chats are nice. I haven't had that since February 28th or whatever. But... Uh, I'm happy. I mean, I've gotten a, there's a lot of people that understand that uh, their information is always held in confidence on YouTube and by me and everything else. So that's been good. It's kind of been a win-win. So it hasn't been that much of a negative. Uh, but with big travel gear and up, it would be nice because there'll be a lot of people watching the Mexico travel and all that example the phrase and that man I'm just disappointed yeah you know my bank started flagging <laughs> from <laughs> Shemay <laughs> or Shemay no 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 good deed goes unpunished the bank's calling Shemay like uh, what's going on here are you money laundering with these dopes on YouTube <laughs> Oh, you got to love that. <clears throat> you can cook a black tip shark on the grill. I won't try to reduce it. That sounds pretty good. I'd like to have a bite of that. Black tip reef sharks. Yeah. Um, so will I be on the road tomorrow? What is tomorrow, Thursday? There's a good chance. Good chance for a little shorty tomorrow. No, YouTube's just been a mess for the last uh, the last two months in particular. I know that they're getting. I know people are trying to hack them like crazy and do stuff right now. Maybe uh, you're not going to try to reduce that. Good. Sounds like a kinky marital way, doesn't it? <laughs> Oh, that's funny. Maybe I... So, guess where we're going in Mexico? Cab's all excited. Guess where we're going? Makes the Jew Jaws theme song. What part of the shark is the uh, black tip? Shark fin! Shark fin. That's right, Mexico City. Where else? <clears throat> Rosie's gone deep probing in Mexico, way down, way down to Mexico City. Okay, take care, Nicole. Thank you, Cheryl Acapulco. Yes, we're going to go to uh, from Tijuana to Mexico City overnight there. Catch a morning flight to Acapulco because it's cheap as hell from Mexico City. We're going to do four nights in Acapulco and then fly to Mexico City, do five nights in Mexico City. And that's going to be awesome. It's going to be a lot of good stuff. Uh, okay, take care, Diane. Thank you. Yeah, it's my fault. Yeah, Mexico City should be a lot of fun. Um, as should Acapulco. It's a level four travel not advised. We'll see how that works out. Maybe I'll have my first uh, uh, gang encounter, right? 
see it will certainly add a little spice to the uh, visit then I get back then I get back from that and uh, take a look at Hawaii at that point or head off to the Dakotas that's going to be a hell of a trip to suss out some of these tiny little tiny little towns and see the stuff nobody else sees Uh, that's going to be uh, going to be good times. Maybe uh oh jeez kid you just kicked the ball into the back lot. This kid's like the worst soccer player in the world. First time he kicks the ball right over over the fence. Unreal. Yeah, Mexico should be fun. Stretch out over here. 500% uh, on AMC. Good for you. Good for you. Maybe uh, time for my afternoon. Oh, constitutional here. Oh, there we go. There we go. AMC theaters. That's good. I've done all right on the airlines. There's a, there's a alien conference next week in my live stream. Okay, where should I go? Yeah, I think is next week when the conference is. Yeah, I'm lying in the grease spots. There it is right here. <laughs> oh, that's too funny. That is too, too funny. Too funny. Get my energy level up for tonight. Jimmy Church, never heard of him, or her, whoever. Taking a break from nonstop dramas. <laughs> well, that's cool. I just, uh, you know, I just, I don't even go near it anymore. Uh, it's just, just, I don't know. Maybe I just reached an age. It's just not fun anymore. Um, fun for me is getting out there on the road and meeting crazy people and doing crazy stuff right <sighs> stretching out does take up much of your time well if you're having fun do it I like to pop on a panel once in a while and just say hi, see how everybody's doing. But uh, I got so much shit I want to do on my own. That just weighs me down. Oh, great. Bob's doing a Q&A. It's not going to be as fun as my Q&A. Right? I bet uh, nobody sends Bob... Uh, sheer bikinis to wear all right thank god uh, interviews kind of like art bell but uh all right. well, i thought you were talking about bob wills oh geez are you kidding me susie we're joined at the hip honey we've been here for years doing this thing i always love my susie send them a black tip shark maybe we should <laughs> yeah, I was talking about Bob Wells, too. I think my Q&As are more fun. You seem knocked out, Rosie. I've just been working today. 
Didn't really sleep too great last night, kitten cat, to tell you the truth. Um, yeah. Just getting ready for the next big adventure. Uh, actually, my energy came up a little bit. You have uh, cold, just allergies. It's that time of year that I take my allergy medicine too. It kind of knocks me out a little bit. It takes a little bit of the edge off. Bobby, the Bobby, the song Janice wrote, Bobby Meyer, yep, that's the Bobby, that's the Bobby, Papa Feud, oh gee, here comes the kid for his ball, shit, did you lose your ball, hello, did you lose your ball, yeah, okay, I'll toss it over the fence, okay, Freaking kids. Oh, Jesus. Which side is it on? The front or the back? I think it's on the I think it's on the back. Okay. Well, I mean the front, like over here, because I'm right. trying to kick it to my friend. Yeah. It, it kind of oh. got kicked around here somewhere. Yeah, I look around over here. Bastard's ball. This, kid, this kid's the most unathletic kid I've ever seen in my life. Oh. oh, boy. You sure it's over here? Are you sure it's over here? I feel like just popping this ball. Up in crows, listen to that. I'd like to hear that shit 24 7. Goddamn crows, look at this shit. Sons of bitches. God damn. <laughs> the crows know it like did <clears throat> Hold on a minute.
Yeah, I was saying sorry about that. I don't know where in the hell the ball went. That must be in a bush or something. Guys are more interested in the YouTube channels. Sorry, it's not for kids. Let's see. Damn. I don't know where that thing went. <laughs> See the damn ball. Kids kicked it over the back or not? <laughs> Yes, I'm married. I have multiple wives. Well, probably up in the bush or something. No, I never put kids on YouTube. No. Kids like, can I be on your YouTube? I'm like, no way, kid. No wonder if Hitchcock liked to film all his movies in this county. Yeah, it's probably in one of the trees here or something. I don't know. Yeah, I kind of saw the ball fly in the corner of my eye over here. I'm always picking up the kids' crap when they... Kids are like the worst athletes in the world. Yeah, hey Harvey, how you doing? Yeah, I see you. Well, I've wasted enough time. Yeah, the crows. The crows, kitten cat, the crows. What the hell it is. <clears throat> oh. Ravens and crows, that's why I like my I like my Baltimore Ravens, right? Although I never remember seeing a raven in Baltimore. Then again, I never saw a Baltimore Oriole in my life. <laughs> eh, another one of those non-existent birds. <clears throat> Fantasy literature. So I don't know where the kid's ball is. I looked around. It'll show up. That was, a, that was a, yeah, that was a workout looking for that for sure. That was a workout. Baltimore Ravens, you gotta love the Ravens. Consistently a great football team. <clears throat> Everybody loves the Ravens. Face it, you love them too. Love them. Oh, you're a Chargers fan, huh? Uh oh, she made like ghost dealers. Out of the game, Ravens and somebody. <laughs> Saints is the court's team. Why well, you like the Saints? 
I don't know. <clears throat> Drew Brees just, he hasn't seemed to be able to do it lately, right? It's like Aaron Rodgers, he just can't close the deal. It's like Lamar Jackson, he just can't close the deal. I can get, uh, you know, one game away from the conference championship. It all turns to shit. <clears throat> I'm more into college football. Get some antibiotics. What do you got, an STD, Harvey? And got bit and my stomach is red hot burning. What the hell? Did you get an STD or something? Oh, Shemay says I take naps. Nap time. Any plans for Pride Month? I don't know. I might go up to Guerneville if they're having the parade up there. I'll probably do some trans topics on the channel. Maybe not. I don't know. Are you all man? Got bitten by something. I wonder why it would affect your stomach. <clears throat> you sure you didn't get a rotten burrito or something, Harvey? Must cook something. Coming up to 2300 hours. 11 o'clock. I'm just dicking off tonight. We're going to be out chooching. I need to get nice and energized. They must have bit my stomach area only on one side. Hmm. Oh no, an important court business. <laughs> oh shit. The Boyd Community Court says, Rosie, I must contact you. I guess they're going to, I guess Boyd Community Court is going to take a deposition from me. You swear to tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth, so I hope you God, I do. Please be seated. Now, as we explained, Miss O'Kelly, when you came in, this is not a formal court proceeding, but the answers you give are, of your testimony are under oath. So please note and be advised of that. So if you have no further questions, we will proceed with the deposition. State your full name. <laughs> uh, one of our court clerks will be in contact briefly. That's it. <laughs> We're going to do a Zoom. We're going to do a Zoom win. Yeah, we rest our case. On or about the evening of March 3rd, 2018. Oh, man, that's funny as hell. <clears throat> At least something new coming along. I like that. Jen Jen's an owner. I should be a prepper. I always keep antibiotics, have more meds than a pharmacy. Um, I don't know if you have an... I wouldn't automatically rush to take antibiotics, Harvey. It's, uh, you know, not everything is, a, is an infection. All right. Did you have your shirt off or something? Yeah, let your immune system work first. Memo said, thank you, Boyd Community Court. I guess I'm going to need to have to testify. <clears throat> it's probably YouTube community versus uh, uh, Christopher Harrelson et al. in the First Circuit. <laughs> I have to... I have to uh, Bring professional, bear professional witness here. Ah, uh, Boyd Community Court. I love that. 
What about uh, antihistamine? Yeah, I think antihistamine is fine. You do not want to bill. You do, yeah, you do not want to exactly. Um, just like when you get your vaccination, they tell you don't take anything that's going to act to lower your body temperature like uh, uh, aspirins or ibuprofen. You want that reaction. You want that. Mm -hmm. I definitely want that. Let's see what else is going on. Rosie Rub says they love you. Yes. Yes. Rub has been a fan for years. Go cook and take a tab. All right, Harvey. All right, mate. Hello, JR. 3530. 3530. That's a lot of flying coming up in Mexico. Kids squawking again. Jeez, oh, here comes the kid again. Jeez. <sighs> Did you find the ball? No, I was gonna ask. Um. The one that had the, um, what is your YouTube channel? Yeah, I don't talk about that, okay? It's not for kids, but, uh, do you have YouTube? Yeah. Good, you having fun on it? Yeah, I yeah. do Fortnite, Apex, GTA. Oh, wow, you're smart. Um, Keep bikes. an eye out for that ball, okay? Okay. Jeez, this kid wants my YouTube channel so bad. Sorry, kid. I hate the way it works. Oh, boy. You never seen me this mellow. You don't usually see me. I'm usually work in the afternoon. He's like, what's your YouTube channel? Like, forget about it, kid. Right? It's not for kids. Uh, no interest in kids on my channel or nothing. <laughs> yeah, I'm mellow. I'm pretty mellow. I'm just chilling out. It's uh, early June. Things have been going pretty good. I'm happy. I'm just uh, all right. chilling out. Made friends with the lady next door. She was a YouTube channel. Going to watch it. Yeah. All uh, well, it's pretty sanitized now, but uh, you know, it's just not. It's not for kids. Work mighty hard to keep that. Uh, even when I'm doing videos and videography, I always keep kids off of stuff. Maybe, uh... Oklahoma Sooners. Sooner rather than later. <laughs> Kitten Cat says, <laughs> I hate kids. You gotta love Kitten Cat's honesty. Jesus, I love Kitten Cat. I hate kids. What are your plans as far as your next trip? My next real trip of substance. Tomorrow might be a little mini trip. Uh, an overnighter. And then I got the weekend. Then I got that jury duty coming up starting Monday. And I got to call in the night before to see if I'm needed to go. Every day I have to call in. And then when that's done, it's probably going to be off to Las Vegas. Uh, like on Wednesday, the following Wednesday, uh, might take off Sunday, I don't know. And then after that, get back from that, that's going to be like uh, mid-June. And then uh, go 
going to take a Southern California trip. There's some more stuff to see down in SoCal. It's going to be all travel in 2021. Uh, more stuff to see in um, uh, SoCal. Some very interesting stuff down there. Uh, and then that's on to on to Mexico. That's going to be almost two weeks. Uh, Mexico City, Acapulco. I mean, Mexico City is going to be fantastic. The food, the street scenes, that's going to be off the hook. And then uh, <clears throat> coming back, it might be uh, Honolulu. Um, you know, depending what the cost is on that, Honolulu. Uh, keeping an eye on Hong Kong to see if that's uh, going to be opening. So lots of stuff coming up. Lots of stuff. The bring, People's Courts brings receipts. Yeah, you thought the kid was going to come in and make a sandwich, huh? I don't know. Street Life, how you doing? Street Life here. <laughs> I love Street Life. Good morning, boy. I love Street Life. Rosie did something last night. Uh, <laughs> uh, <clears throat> Rosie's always at church and doing something. But uh, I think Street Life is an excellent commentator and a very interesting uh, person. So just to give you a heads up, Street Life, I'll be out doing something tonight. And <laughs> well, I'll be looking forward to the street. Yeah, the street foods in Mexico. Uh, Cap knows Mexico City. Have nose Acapulco, so that's good. I'm not really so much into cultural things. I want the flavor of the place. I don't want to, you know, the Frida Kahalo Museum, that woman that's got one eyebrow or whatever in Mexico. I mean, uh, she does good work and stuff like that, but, uh, you know, I want to be out on the streets. I want to, I want to, you know, I'll, I'll do the odd cathedral here and there, but, you know. Uh, Nicholas, I played football growing up, Little League football. To high. Nice. Nice. Like that football. Fish tacos. I think the beef in Mexico City is supposed to be awesome. And uh, Acapulco will be about the seafood. And uh, I told Kev I'm not staying in any shitbag motel down there. But they're cheap. They're not expensive. Nice places. Maybe. Uh, so lots of adventures coming up. Then it's up to uh, probably be up to the Dakotas. I really got an itch to see North Dakota and see some of those little small towns and try to understand what the hell these people were thinking about living up there and figure stuff out. Meet some locals. All right. Maybe help a farmer for a day. <laughs> and bullfighting in Mexico. Da -da -da. Da -ba 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 -da -da. El Matador. El Toro. I agree. Used to man. What is that? I used to. Mazalon fishing with my gramps growing up. Good place. Yeah, Mazalon. Yeah. Corey Mason, if you've heard of her. I don't know. <clears throat> I'm still kind of sweet on Valerie Burton Alley. <laughs> uh, what a life. What a life. Red Cape. What's up, Pansy? How you doing? Boy, I heard you guys have been pounded with rain. Eddie's old flame. That's right. I was so jealous of Eddie. That was my girl. Great vacation spot. Great food and fishing. Well, ultimately, I want to get down to South America, to Buenos Aires, and Chile, Vindemar, and Valparaiso. 
Going to the full flight. Going to the bull. Yeah, I'm not sure what we're going to do. I'll tell you one damn thing, Street Life. I ain't going to be hauling around any friggin' art museums and stuff. I'm going to be out living the life. Checking out the locals. Checking out the street food. You know, trying to bullshit with some locals. See what's going on down there. Chile and Argentina. No, I don't enjoy it. I don't have a lot of interest in Brazil. Don't have a lot of interest in Brazil. I want to go up on one of those uh, crazy roads with a trucker up in the Andes, right? Finding 13th gear. And... Riding around some of those crazy ass twisting turns, that'd be cool. All right, but Acapulco is all gonna be about the beach. I think this hotel is right on the beach and uh, get some sun, chill out. I'm gonna be Chargers game in Baltimore this year, it'll be my Chargers jersey, they'll be ready for you. Let me tell you what, you come to Chargers, come to Baltimore, you better believe the Ravens will have that welcome wagon out. I would make a beeline for your car afterwards. <laughs> you don't want to be goofing around in uh, Baltimore City after a game, right? Ooh, <clears throat> be careful in AC, of course, I'm always careful. Acapulco is a level four travel not advised. That's what makes it cheap. How you doing, Ashley? I'm doing good. I'm just kind of chilling out a little bit, just having a little mellow chat. I'm going to be out in Petaluma tonight doing a big chooch. So, yeah, my, two, my road is washing. I don't, I don't remember a year with this. Yeah, isn't it crazy, Chef? Just terrible. Phil Rivers, huh? My favorite charger was Lance Allworth. Fun and good times. Uh, <clears throat> We are that old. <laughs> You're only as young as you feel, Pansy. I've been feeling rather frisky the last few days. Dan Fouts, Kellen Winslow. Yeah, I've been to Atlantic City many times. When I lived in Baltimore, uh, I used to drive up in my 68 Mustang every weekend to Atlantic City across the Delaware Memorial Bridge. And I would go up to Gamble at uh, Resorts International, the Clare Ridge, the Trump Plaza, the Taj Mahal. Uh, just did all that shit till one day I broke the Mustang broke down. I had to be towed all the way back from the Pine Barrens in southern Jersey. That sucked because I had some Bible pump, Bible thumper, and his son just chewing my ear off for a hundred miles or whatever. Nixon Nicks Hawks. Uh. I don't know. I'm more watching Brooklyn and all that. I don't really follow too much on the Knicks. AC Expressway. Yeah, you go across the Delaware Memorial Bridge and then on to the uh, Garden State Parkway or the Atlantic City Parkway across the... Uh, up there. That was a lot of years ago. Yeah, the Bible pimps. They just... I just told the guy finally just shut up. You know, I got to Bel Air, Maryland... It's still about 40 miles from Baltimore, 50 miles. I'm just like, hey, man, just shut up. I'm paying you to tow me. I don't need to hear about the 
12 tribes of Israel or whatever. Or, Jesus, knucklehead. Still remember that. Yeah. Costa Rica. No, I don't want to go to Costa Rica. It's like, it's just. Costa Rica is not what it used to be. Belize isn't what it used to be. It's all overrun by Americans and. Uh, you know, all, all the uh, whoremongering and all that shit down there. Don't like that. What's up, skunk? Yeah, White Horse Pike, right into AC. Sound like he... No, he wasn't a moron. He had it outside of his place. It was in... God, what was the town of Mawa or something? Or Mawa, New Jersey. He was in Mawa. And he had the flags of like the 12 tribes of Israel. And he started telling me how they dispersed all over. And... uh you know, I probably already lost like 200 bucks. I was already feeling like shit. And it's not off, and I just ended up like tearing the guy's head off, right? And the son's like, ooh. Okay. And I'm paying 100 bucks to get towed, which was a lot of money in 1980 or whatever. Uh, New Jersey and Trenton, you were attacked by a raccoon today. Good Lord, skunk. That's terrible. I'm not sure if it's Mawa or what the hell it was. It was uh, something. I don't know. You're crossing across the Pine Barrens there. I don't know whether it's Route 40 or what the hell it is. I don't know. I'd know if I saw it on the map. guy was just weird just weird hey CJ how you doing welcome to the afternoon snooze fest here <laughs> just chilling yeah. I'd love to know what the hell the name of that town was I just can't remember we used to go across the Delaware Memorial Bridge Used to go up 95, then go across the Chesapeake and Delaware Canal over over across the Delaware Memorial Bridge. Drop down into New Jersey right there, and then head out on 40 or something, and you would go through the Pine Barrens. I don't, I can't remember what the hell that town was called. Can't remember what the hell that town was called. Yeah, looked like I needed that. The mean streets of Lawrenceville. You got some little fox that show. I'm afraid of anything. Foxes, all that shit. No, I just don't. Uh, you just see me with that makeup today. I'm just uh, dicking around the house. I'm going to be out chooching tonight. We're going to go to Pataluma. Hit some of the alleys of doom. See what's going on down there. I'm just excited for Mexico, man. Mexico City, Acapulco. Jesus, travel galore. Up, up to the Dakotas. I'm going up to the Badlands, man. I hope there's some vicious thunderheads and tornadoes and all that. I think that'd be really cool. Another great show. Yeah. You. Madawan, yeah, was that it? Yeah, how you doing today, CJ? What Madawan? Yeah, I'm going down or invade Sturgis. Maybe one of the guys will put me on the bitch seat in the back on the on the bikini in the back, huh? I don't know. Sturgis. I never had a lot of interest in biker guys. Raccoon was in my attic. I caught him, jumped on me. I fell through. The, oh, Jesus. You fell through the sheetrock? Wow. Yeah, I told you, man. These animals are vicious. Squirrels, raccoons, pigeons, sparrows. Any of those things can just attack you in force. 
Imagine you fell through the sheetrock between the uh, between the rafters up there, huh? Between the uh, it's a hard landing. Yeah, make sure you get a video of that. <laughs> Pansy. <laughs> Ah, Trenton, New Jersey is rough or was rough. Uh, I'll tell you what, go to Camden, right? Go across from Philadelphia there. You want to talk about rough or pop down to Baltimore, man, or uh, East Philadelphia. Hmm? You'll be raising your voice a couple octaves going down those streets. Oh, my God. Don't stop. Don't stop. Don't stop with the light. Just keep going. <laughs> it's funny as hell. Yeah, the Mount Washington Bridge. Home of Campbell, Campbell Soup. Used to be the... Uh, I don't know if that was a one-time home of the uh, Radio Corporation of America, too, RCA. His master's voice, Nipper. Nipper. Yep, yeah, just chilling out today. Everybody's entitled to just goof off. I didn't have to go to work today. Didn't have to go to work. Today I was walking out and saw two girls making out. First thing I said was, whoa. I've made out with a few girls in my time. I won't tell them ran down this cat when corner turned out to be a raccoon. Lord almighty. Campbell soup. Oh, you're tired? Sorry, CJ. You've been going at it pretty good on your channel. I've been kind of slacking back. Um... I like to go in bursts, you know, and then I got big travels in Mexico and stuff. So I like to just take a couple weeks and just chill and and uh, just take it easy and then re-energize again. That's kind of what I'm in now is a little bit of a chill out mode right now. Ooh, raccoons not paying rent these days. They're getting the stimulus checks. <laughs> I uh, cleaned the Sherwood today. Oh yeah, I love Sherwoods. Nice, uh, nice units in my bench. Good for you, Nina. Uh, yeah, it's been crazy. So I'll just you got to take some downtime. Hey, Welsh. Yeah. You know, it's uh, you know, so I haven't been around too much. I haven't been on any panels just kind of doing my edit I had a crap load of editing to do after uh, Southern California and uh, Ensenada and all that Welsh boo looking good on the chill yes I hey, Molly how you doing hey wanna wander voice to text you're making me yawn <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mountain lions scare me. That's what I worry about. When I'm out at cemeteries at night, that's my biggest fear uh, out here. Is we definitely have big-ass mountain lions out here. And I look like a very tasty morsel. A nice bite-sized little morsel. Uh, hope I get it. Country boy. All right, take care, Pansy. Yeah, you too, honey. Post some good hangouts. I like your music ones. I'll pop by sometime. I'm just never around when you're going live, so just get the cat, hit the cat, pet the cat on the head. It's good. Fisher cats in the woods around here. Yeah, I'm what's considered a trans lesbian. I guess you'd call that. Or straight <laughs> never quite figured out what the hell i am <laughs> i'm just damn interesting you should see the wildflowers here so pretty white red yellow nice 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 flowers do 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 
hard to believe this year's almost half over. Uh, sipping on a Guinness Blonde. Strange finish interesting. Yeah, I like the Guinness Dark. That's my favorite dark beer. That's my fave. Yeah, I'm just bombing around today. I don't think I've been in the on in the afternoon in years. Oh, my mom and I picked up guitars. Now we, oh, that's really cool. You, she has an acoustic and I have an electric. That is fantastic. You're gonna like it. You're gonna enjoy that. Wow, awesome guitars. Your mom got an acoustic and you got an electric. That's really cool. Nice. Delightfully confusing. Here too, Red Road Runner. We're just winding down allergy season here too. Well guys, I'm going to go ahead and um, close this out. Thank you for coming. I don't think I'm going to keep this hang out up. I was just killing time today while I cleaned up the shop a little bit. I will be back tonight. We will be down in Petaluma. We will be Chuchin. You're headed to Alaska. No service. I won't be able to. Okay, well, be safe out there, Marquise. Like the extra stout. So good. Yeah, you be careful up there to Alaska, okay? Be damned. Mosquitoes. Oh, no. Yeah, thanks for the chill sesh, guys. Just hanging out with me on a little mini chat today. I had a good time. Got a little bit of cleanup done. I will see you guys tonight for the main event. Petaluma. See you soon.